So guys, we're back out today at one of my favorite parks, Nayak Park here in Scranton, Pennsylvania. We're here today because I just finished up doing a product review with Mike from Out Naturing, who is back there getting some footage. This is the first time making a video here. And we're actually right now headed through this little forest to check out the train tunnel that we've seen in other videos. We're gonna give him a shot at that. But you can see it's snowy here, it's cold, and we're gonna get some ice, uh, Nice footage of the icicles, the frozen water, and the gorge area. So it's not going to be a long, detailed video. They have made multiple videos here. I just wanted to give you a look at this park here in the wintertime with a decently fresh snowfall and a whole new perspective as to how things look in the wintertime. So if you want to come on a little bit of an adventure with me, then come along with me. It's a pretty nice forest area here with all the rhododendrons. And right down here is the river. But we're going to continue forward though to get to the train tunnel. It's going to look pretty nice this time of year. Where do you guys see this? I'm gonna spin you around. There's some frozen cascading waterfalls here. Take a look at this. Yeah. Get a close look at those icicles. Let's go check it out. Wow, look at that. That formation is incredible. Also, very dangerous. You wouldn't want to stand under that, but that is amazing. It's almost like slide tights. So, forming stalagmites. Wow, that is gorgeous. Is that cool or what? Man, this is something else. If you're enjoying this video so far, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It's free and it only takes a second. So we're now taking a walk on what is called the Davis Trail. We just left the, the Kondorsky Bridge and the tunnel area, and now we're gonna be following this trail to get some pretty cool footage of the gorge area, which is just down to the bottom of here. But we'll give you a little bit of footage along the way. And once we get closer, give you probably some slow motion footage of it and uh, some different views of it. But I want your uh, feedback, as I always ask, I am using the new DJI Osmo action camera. I did use this on a couple other videos here and there but I want to see how you think it's performing for this video. I can't zoom in on anything but you should be able to see everything nice and crisp and clear and a nice wide angle and hopefully audio is good as too as well. But uh, make sure you leave me a comment let me know what you think of it.
Oh, I see here. I'm gonna bring my ice skates. I thought about putting you on the chest mount so you can feel like you're walking the trail with me, but then I have to remove it again to get the slow motion footage and other footage I'm gonna get. So I'm gonna keep you on the selfie stick the whole time. All right, this is our final descent. As you can see, it is difficult, so I'm gonna pause on filming and pick up at the bottom. So we arrived, it is icy here, but we're gonna try our best to give you some looks at it. Oh. All right, let's give me your look at it. Not frozen, but still looks cool. That's a pretty gorgeous shot right there at the train bridge. But this looks completely different this time of year. I was here a couple years ago when the gorge waterfall is completely frozen I will link that down below in the description but it still looks equally as nice but we're gonna get closer though get you some close-up looks at it and a little slow motion action
Okay guys, I want to thank you for joining me here today at Nag Park. Myself and Mike Mount Naturing did film some incredible footage here at the waterfall, the ice, the snow. Just made for a really beautiful video. And we we're already here for another reason to do a different video. So we figured, hey, why not show what the park looks like today, January 2020. I know I filmed here before, but this is a different look at it from other videos. And hopefully you enjoyed the footage. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. It lets me know that you enjoy this type of content. I love making it for you and I, I think with the uh, hyperlapse and the slow motion and the music and the photos that it made for a pretty good video. So if you want to see more videos like this just comment down below tell me yes I want to see more videos just like this and I could definitely do my best to pump them out for you. Don't forget to check out Mike's channel it will be linked down below so you can see his perspective from today's adventure and also links to my Facebook page, merchandise shop and everything else that you may need to know including my P.O. Box, if you wish to send me items which will be unboxed live on my Sunday night live streams. Anyways, guys, I want to thank you so much for joining me today. I had a great time, and despite the cold, I think it was worth the effort to come here and share this some amazing footage. So, thank you so much, and until next time, I'll see you in the next video.